All right, what's up, guys? It's Isaac here, Tobacco Road Harley Davidson in Raleigh, North Carolina, with your pre owned bike of the week, a 2008 Road King. So, pretty sweet, rocking the 96 twin cam. Lots of good stuff on this bike. Uh, let's see, you got a nice, nice little classic Road King, little crossbar there for your brake lights. Uh, looks like pretty regular. Uh, slightly upgraded exhaust, can't quite tell what those are, I don't see any markings. Um, yeah, there we've got the powerhouse of this motor. Six-speed transmission. It is cool little bags. This is the ones that do the interesting little uh, kind of fold up and out instead of the nice easy little latch there. Uh, but this one works plenty well. You can still carry all your luggage in there. Um, and then you will see that you do have the nice white wall tires. Look great. Nice big lights. Nice big lights up here in the front. Uh, to really kind of light the way and make this bright. Make this bike nice and bright and it looks like a little led inserts in there as well so let's go ahead and fire this motorcycle up here for you as you can see it does have eighty-five thousand miles on it this thing has been ridden she's been ridden pretty good but she's still ready to go oh yeah so you've got a bike here that's i don't want to say well worn more like well broken in so She's ready to go. A little bit of work done, make her go uh, a little bit quicker, a little bit smoother. So I'll go ahead and throw this key in my pocket. So this one, since this one is the older 08 style, um, what that's gonna mean is that you've got, there's no uh, little security fob. The only way to really lock this bike is uh, the little uh, piece up here in the neck to lock the steering. Oh, sorry, it's right up here up top on the Road Kings. You'll have to lock that to lock your steering and then to keep people from cutting the bike on, flip that in right there. Easy as that. So, let's go ahead and stand it on up. Nice, uh, good suspension. Probably roll these bars back just a little bit. It's an interesting uh, kind of forward motion here we got. So, let's go see what she's all about. Feels good. Very responsive in the hand. Oh yeah. It's very responsive, very flickable. This little girl's ready to go. Okay. Holy cow. This thing is smooth. Bars aren't my favorite, not gonna lie, uh, but pretty good. Let's see, oh, we got a jogger. Sounds good. It's got that perfect amount of rumble to it. Sounds like a motorcycle, but it's not overbearing, you know? It's got a clean truck at the work site. This thing is smooth. Um, I want to say one of our uh, hog members here in the Raleigh Hog chapter, uh, old Steve. Steve has put, I think he hit the 160,000 mile mark on his Road King. I want to say it's like, an, I don't think it's an 08, um, but it's in that year, it's in that time frame. Um, so, I mean, it's got his 160,000 mile Road King going strong. Uh, so if that tells you anything, these things are made to, made to go. King of the road, that's for sure. Wow, that's a king of how responsive and just smooth this is. You can feel a little bit of vibration in it, um, so far as like, you know, you know it's running, so it's definitely not quite as, uh, smooth as the newer Milwaukee 8s. Wow, oh, lots of power. But uh, she's ready to party right here with you. It does have the heel shifter, a little extra comfort there. Ooh, Hyundai partying. Ooh, Hyundai breaking in the turn. We love that. Let's see here. It does have cruise control, looks like. Ooh, old school button. Oh, it 
is the old school cruise system here. Let's see, a little late. Let's see if these folks will be uh, kind enough to let us on over here. Ease it on up a bit. Wow! Let me fix my mirror a tiny bit. Oh, yeah. bit more. All right. Now we're just doing it on the highway. We're going 55. We should have to be doing higher on the highway. I believe this bike might have a gear RPM. So we just cycle it through here. Trip A, trip B. Fuel range. Lock. Give a party a little bit. It's got our clock and then we've got that's it. No RPM, but you got your ears. That's all you need. Oh yeah. Party right here. We got plenty of room to the left. Trailblazer can see us. We're gonna take this exit on. Oh yeah. She's partying. Feels very smooth. Just kind of like it. this old girl wants to go right here. Power's fantastic. You know, it's an older touring bike. She looks good too. Black and chrome, white walls. This thing is classic. I'm excited to see how she does in some turns here in just a minute. That we might have come in a little bit late. About to hit some traffic. Should we change it up today? Let's see. Oh, this thing feels good. Listen to that rumble, rumble. Pop, 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 pop. Fantastic. Alrighty, yeah. Wow. I'm digging it. Um, four boards, nice room, engine guard, prop your feet up. Now, if you're going to tell that guy later and be like, wow, I see why you have so many miles on your bike. a soft tail but this thing I'm looking at really doing some serious miles Road King would be up oh yeah I just like the soft tail so much more over touring bikes just because um, they're just lighter so I can do I feel like I can do a little bit I don't feel as bad driving them in sketchier places like the backwoods at a campsite somewhere. Uh, granted, I did it with a street glide and it was fine. Um, but uh, I wouldn't mind uh, I mean, doing some serious miles. Like, this thing can do it. Clearly. Let's see, is the light going to be kind to us today? I will come to a complete stop here. We're soaking it up today. It's a gorgeous day too, not too cold, still a bit of light left. Might do a shoot another video after this one. Um, yeah, we're soaking it up in Raleigh, North Carolina. It's pretty beautiful. We've got a beautiful looking bike going showing it off. I love the uh I do enjoy the benefits of a fairing, you know, you can kind of tuck it behind it, be good to go, but on nice weather days, you know, soak it in, kind of feel the breeze, that's what it's all about. Do it just like that. Maybe get you a little Memphis Shades, quick detached fairing, so you can enjoy the benefits of a fairing when you need it. But, uh, look cool, soak in some warmth when you don't. So you get some speed here. Wow. So 
one of those bikes that can just pick up speed and you really don't even feel it. The seat's nice and cushiony. Oh yeah. I think it's a big 60 gallon tank too. It's got a fuel gauge, a fuel range. Let's go soak up some scenery in here. Oh yeah. A little bit older twin cam. A little more affordable. Oh yeah, it's winter out here now. They also ease off the throttle for these folks. Let's ease up a good bit. I kind of want to see how this thing leans. I don't quite want to scrape these bags off here, but... Oh yeah. Go. This is nice. You hop on a highway somewhere and just point it and send it. Go party with a Nissan Altima somewhere. Let's see. Wow. Yeah, the bars are nice, but could be a little bit better on it. Um, I don't know, I mean, I guess, you know, if I'm really trying to be riding this thing pretty aggressive, or if I was just taller and had longer arms, I might enjoy it more. Scroll it on in. It's a mighty fine gap right there. Would be a shame. Oh, oh yeah. Like you can take anywhere. Um, I know I made the comments about the lighter, but this one is a little bit lighter, you know? This one's got a few heck less pounds on it. And for all my twin cam people, it's a twin cam. She's doing a mighty fine. Shift over right quick. Oh yeah. Rumble, rumble. Let's pop a right right here. Pop a right, not pop a right. to be sent. Wow. Man, this bike is just, this bike just makes riding that perfect amount of easy, where it's not so easy that, you know, you might as well drive a car, but easy and but still rough enough that, you know, you're on Harley Davidson. Oh yeah. Tracks just as smooth and straight. Little bump. Pretty good suspension in the rear, I'll give you that. You can tell it's said it'd be a touring bike. Oh yeah. Oh, I guess we'll. Go ahead and come to 
a nice little stop here. Let's see, what are we seeing about this thing? It's fantastic. Um, nice bright headlight. Can I see it shining anything? No. I don't see anything I can reflect it off of out there. It's a nice, simple little winter day out here. A good day to be on a motorcycle. Fortunate for us. I'm not in love with the heel shifter uh, just because it feels like it's kind of giving me a little bit less room to move my foot around on the bike. Um, but I dig it. Yeah, I would like that little bit extra room there to put my foot. Um, but we are soaking it up right here. campus handles uh, those highway speeds just as well as it's handling this nice easy cruising smooth slow riding let's see it's just so flickable too it's kind of got that really nice perch point where you're kind of perched up on the bike and can really whip it around underneath you very very well uh, this bike definitely feels like one uh, with the right amount of practice you could do some pretty gnarly uh, slow speed maneuvers on. I'd give you that. So, let's see here. Let's throw him that right turn signal here. Oh, I think today is the uh, last day of classes for these NC State folk. These uh, folks about to go into their exam season. Best of luck to you, folks. Enjoy it. <laughs> Don't freak out. <laughs> Make sure that soccer ball, we're not about to catch one here. done riding this old bike yet. Still got a little bit to cover. Because of how good it is. Let's see if we can stop up right uh, No, I, I butchered that one. Came in too hot. Give him a little uh, blip. Let him know we're back here. I see our LEDs are looking nice and bright. Do our quick little check for traffic. Apologies in advance, you're gonna, I guess not in advance now, but you're gonna hear me say, oh yeah, about, about 35 times in this video, like I'm the Kool-Aid man or something out here. So, oh, they got the Raleigh Night of Lights out there. I have yet to make it to it. Um, here it's a wonderful little uh, program they put on out there. Uh, go check it out if you're in the Raleigh area, or if you're not in the Raleigh area, come drive out here. I would say ride. This, this might be one of the few times I'm going to not recommend you ride. And that's to the Night of Lights thing. Uh, because you will be sitting on your motorcycle, cutting it on, cutting it off, and uh, it's not going to be fun. You're just going to be sitting on the bike. You know, if I'm going to be on the bike, I'd rather be riding, you know. I love seeing motorcycles in parades, but I would not want to be the one riding them in the parade. Uh, my clutch gets enough abuse as it is. Um, 
But yeah, uh, go check it out. Uh, nice little bring the whole load up the family in the car, go take them out there. I don't know what the cost is on it. It's a uh, done it yet I might go do it you know we'll see we'll see we'll see um, I'll let you, if I do go I'll let you guys know how it was um, let's scope it out for you let's go hop in traffic here Uh, yeah, so the only re so <laughs> one of the uh, reasons I'd like to consider myself uh, experienced in a uh, not <laughs> motorcycle friendly lines um, back when uh, the COVID stuff was getting uh, pretty bad out in Raleigh, and you had to be COVID tested for different things. That was a fun time. So. Oh, Bobber Nate. Excellent. Fantastic, sir. So one of the uh, things there. Um, so I, you know, I had to go get a COVID test. Uh, like probably most Americans had to. Um, and little did I know how Wake County was doing the process um, was not as educated as I should have been at the time. Well, I see they have plenty of breaker fluid uh, in their vehicle today. Uh, the old Prius C, it's got a goddamn fish tank in their tail light. Brother's got an ecosystem in there. <laughs> um, but uh, so you know, I went online, made my appointment, all that kind of stuff to go hop in and try to try to get a COVID test. And it was like, boom, you've got an eight o'clock appointment. And I was like, bet, easy as that. So I was like, all right, well, I'm gonna take the motorcycle because you know that's that's what I do. So I hopped on the bike. Yeah, you know, I was like, yeah, it's a little bit nippy. So figured, yeah, it's not far. Threw on a little jacket, hopped on the bike, rode out there. And then I saw a few cars in the line in a line, and I was like, oh shoot, like. I didn't realize there was going to be a line, like I thought I had a little appointment, so I thought it'd be fine. Um, silly me. And, uh, I was not fine. Um, there was, uh, <laughs> the problem there was, uh, then I was like, okay, I'll just go around the corner, hop in the back of the line. Well, I ran, went around the corner, and then I saw the mile-long line, and was like, oh, Good, excellent. <laughs> Let's uh, chill in that on the motorcycle. So, I went to the back of the line and you know just shut the bike off because it's an air cooled motor without a fan on it is uh, not really made to just sit there and idle all the time. So, at least not that long. So, sat in the back of the line and fortunately, you know, is there was a lot of downhill portions, so I just. You know, I kind of waited it out and did uh, kind of just coasted it down the downhills and cut it on if I had to, and then just kind of cut it off pretty quick afterwards. Let's see, let's not scrape a ton of this out. There we go. Nice little pool. Yeah, it's whipping here at the back of the dealership. Maybe we can see Raleigh through the mirror. That's a cool shot. I don't know if I got it. Um, yeah, so that was uh, not the uh, best experience. Um, but uh, the people thought it was super cool. Um, they were like, oh, sick, like a motorcycle. It definitely got some pretty good treatment out there, I'd say. Because uh, they were like, oh, like, 
that's cool. Like, this guy's an idiot. But he took his bike out here, so I'll give him that. So, and here we are. Welcome back to Tobacco Road Harley Davidson. Here we have the dealership. There's the service department. Nice, uh, fresh painted lines. Good sound and a rumbling motor. Oh, yeah. Plenty fun, plenty good. If you're looking for a touring motorcycle from Harley Davidson, and more specifically, Tobacco Road Harley Davidson, your local dealership out here, um, come see us and see this bike. Uh, you know, there's tons of things, cool things about it. You know, do you have your cruise control? I didn't demonstrate it, but it's one. So, this one, the, this is old school. This is cool. So, to cut it on, you flip it on like that, and then I assume the light would cut on there. And then to set it, you just bring it in there. And then, you know, go up, up, down a little bit there. Super cool. Cut it off just like that. Easy as that. Or of cups, the brakes, and that kind of thing. So, awesome bike. Uh, you know, if you're looking for a touring bike that doesn't really it's a little bit a little bit older a little bit more affordable and you really want something that's really made to you know crush some miles and definitely swing out here at tobacco road harley davidson and check it out so in the meantime ride safe and we hope to see you soon